Hello and welcome to my channel. In this tutorial we're gonna do a very basic beginner stitch. This stitch is worked in uh, in rounds. So if you want the look only like this, you're gonna have to work in uh, in rounds, not flat. You know, like you do an infinity scarf or you do a hat, that kind of thing. It's very easy but it's gonna eat a lot of yarn. It's just one row repeat so you're gonna do just one row over and over again, but it's gonna eat a lot of yarn, a lot. So be ready. Okay, this stitch works with multiples of four, and I chain my multiples of four here. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna skip the first three chains, one, two, three, and in the fourth chain from the hook, yarn over the hook, we go there, and we're gonna do three double crochet together. Go back again, do the second double crochet, and go back again and do the third one. When you have four loops on your hook, yarn over and pull the yarn through all four loops, chain one. Yarn over the hook, skip the next stitch, and in the next stitch, we're gonna do three double crochet together. Go back again into the same chain and do the second double crochet and the third one, four loops, pull the yarn through all four loops, chain one. So yarn over the hook, skip the next stitch and in the next we're gonna do the same. Three double crochet together. Pull the yarn through all four loops, chain one. So again, you're going to skip the next stitch, and in the next stitch, we're doing the same. Four loops, pull the yarn through all four loops, chain one. And we're going to do the same. Skip the next stitch, and in the next, we're going to do three double crochet together. in the same chain. So four loops, pull the yarn through all four loops, chain one. And again, we skip the next stitch and in the next we're doing the same. Three double crochet together. Well, this is a nice one when you're bored and you want to do something easy that doesn't require you to pay attention so, so much, you can use this stitch. And you chain one, yarn over the hook, you're left with two chains, skip the next chain, and in the last chain we're gonna do only one double crochet, only one. Chain three, turn your work, and now in this first space here, yarn over the hook, we're gonna do three double crochet together. So It's very easy this one. Four loops, pull the yarn through all four loops, chain one. Now you move to the next space, because with this you're going to work into the spaces and last you're going to do a double crochet at the end. So move to the next space, skip all this and do three double crochet together. And you move to the next space and you do like this. Three double crochet together, four loops, pull the yarn through all four loops, chain one. And you move to the next space, and you do three double crochet together, chain one, and you're doing the same. And now you have the last uh, space here, you're going to go in there and going to do the same, three double crochet together. Chain one. And now you're going to skip this one, this three double crochet together. And on top here, the, the chain three that we skipped here on top, you're going to go into the chain and you're going to do a double crochet. You're always going to finish with a double crochet with this stitch. Chain three. Turn your work, it's 
it's gonna look like this you see you have first row you have you know looks like this but the next one looks different so if you want only the first row like this one if you want only this then you're gonna have to go to work in rounds there is no other way otherwise the back is gonna you know the second row that we have here it's on the back the whole work so yeah I think it looks much nicer with the with the first row than the the second but maybe some of you are gonna like it so you're gonna repeat you go into the first space here and you do three double crochet together pull the yarn through all four loops chain one and move to the next space and do three double crochet together if I move too fast you can slow down the video especially those of you that you know you just started to crochet so you do like this move to the next space three double crochet together four loops pull the yarn through all four loops chain one and so on move to the next space three double crochet together you have four loops pull the yarn through all four loops chain one the last space is here of the row you do three double crochet together pull the yarn through all four loops chain one and you have the chain you skip this three double crochet together and on top here the chain three you're gonna do a double crochet and you're gonna chain three and you're gonna start again the first space here you do three double crochet together you move to the next space three double crochet together and you know in all spaces when you reach the end the last space is here you do three double crochet together and uh, the chain three here right there on top you're gonna do a double crochet chain three and you start again this is it but it looks much better like this in rounds but if you like the way it is now what we worked up until now that's fine go ahead and do do this I think for a blanket again you have a bunch of yarn and you don't know what to do make a you know do a blanket and use this it's, it looks a little bit like the you know the granny stitch so yeah it's really nice if you like to to work in uh, and in here you will see the the seam that goes you know when we reach this is the the end and you know whatever we do we join and do three double crochet and then work the stitch but the whole work looks like this and the, this is the back it looks like this the back so if you like this one like this or you like the, the other side you choose which one you want to do it looks like this well I hope you enjoyed the tutorial well give it a try it's a very easy uh, stitch and it's nice that you know you can do whatever you, you like to do blankets hats scarves whatever you you like to do yeah okay well thank you for watching have a great day bye bye